All right, so we got a A7R. We're gonna do the the water test to see what, what type of shutter shake there is in the, on this camera. So right now I have it set at a one second one second shutter. So we should see it, it pop, and then also another another shake when it shuts it. Well, let's see here. All right. See a little bit. One, one more time. All right, we'll get a little bit closer here. Hey, add back up a little bit more. Okay. Let's see what we got. A little bit right there. All right. And then next to it here, we have a 5D Mark III. Now, Ooh, I wonder what type of shutter shape we'll see on this camera. Yeah. All right. Put our scientific water up there. Lock that down, all right, and, oh, uh, I gotta turn it on. All right. Oh, hold on, I gotta put my delay on. Let me make sure the focus is in on. Yeah, looking good, okay. Alright, we see that one shakes also. A little bit. It almost looks worse. It almost does. I don't know, I guess you guys can be the judge. Let's get this up higher. And there we go. One more. We're gonna go ten seconds because I see. I think I'm bumping. The water is still a little bit moved around, so we'll go ten. I mean, this is a, be a longer one, but a little more legit. All right. Well, let's go with. We'll go a ten second on, or a ten second on the the uh, A7R also to see what we get. So, all right, we'll put this right over there. I mean, there's no denying that the, the A7R's got a, a weird shutter. I'm not gonna deny that, that's the truth. All right, we'll do one more. If you guys get a good look at it. I don't know, all right, that's for you to guys decide. What are your thoughts? 
I can uh, also try this with the uh, A6000 if you really want me to also, just to see if there's much of a difference between that and then the 5D3. But there's a little setup. Uh, also, the, so the, uh, the Canon has a 85.18 on it. The A7R has a, the 55.1.8 on it. So, FYI.